Hey, this is Ryan Bowman with Web Eminence. Thanks for watching. I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of the Weebly website builder. I'm doing a review on my website and want to give you kind of a behind the scenes look at how Weebly website builder works and how easy it is to use. So I'm already logged into my website here and this is this is an example website I created. So down at the bottom you can see the website preview. And above this orange line are all the elements you can use to build your website. So these are the basic elements, a paragraph with title, paragraph with picture, picture and title, paragraph individually, contact form. You can drag columns to your page, buttons, custom HTML, and a search box is in the pro version. So all of these elements can easily be dragged right onto your page and I'll show you how easy it is if you were to just drag the paragraph with picture element you drag it down to your page and this little orange line pops up to show you where it's going to be dropped so if I wanted to put it at the top of my page I would just let go of the button and the element would be added and I can click right here to edit I can add an image from my computer or from a URL online and if you want to delete an image or an element, you just scroll over the image or the element in this case and just press the red X and say yes to delete the element. So that's how easy it is to drag and drop all of these elements right onto your website. So you'll see like this page I created, for example, has a paragraph with picture element here an HTML, HTML code element where I added a Twitter widget from my Twitter account. Here is a contact form that I added using the contact form element. And here you can see two buttons that were added using the button element. And all of these items can be easily customized by clicking on them. Here if you're editing text you'll see all the basic functions for editing text like bold, italics, under, underline, you can add links, you can add numbered lists and bulleted lists, I can easily edit pictures with borders, change the color, the positioning, I can edit buttons for style, change the link in the alignment. So every element within Weebly, once it's placed, is very easy to customize. So that's the Elements tab under the Basic menu. So if I go to the next menu called Multimedia, you'll see a whole different menu of multimedia elements like a photo gallery, slideshow, audio player and video player which are available in Weebly Pro. You can also embed documents, use flash objects, Google Maps and easily add YouTube videos. Under the revenue tab there's an element to easily add Google AdSense blocks and also different product blocks. If you want to sell a few products on your website through PayPal or Google Wallet, it's easy to do with Weebly. If you're selling, you know, hundreds of products, I would wouldn't recommend Weebly, but it works for selling a few products. And then there's there's a bunch of other elements under the more tab. And a lot of these are more specialty elements that you may or may not use. So that's the elements tab. That is where you go to drag elements to your website and create your website. Under the design tab you can customize the look of your website. And the first thing you can do is choose a theme. And there's over 200 themes you can choose on Weebly and you see how easy it is. I've already ch chosen a theme but I can just click the preview button and it'll add another theme to my website and show me what it looks like. So you can easily change back and forth from different themes and preview them. There's a lot of design elements under the design options menu that can be customized to change the look of your website, like turning off some of these options, social media, phone number field, 
search box is available in Pro. You can change the text, font, color, and size for different elements of your website, like the site title, paragraph titles, paragraph text, and links. So those are some ways to just change the overall look and design of your website. It's very easy to do. The next tab on the website builder is called pages, and this is where you manage the pages on your website. So over on the left side, these tabs are my pages that are already created, and they can be easily dragged and dropped to change the order of the pages within your menu. You can add a new standard page, blog page, or external link to a website outside your own. And then within the page options, you can change the page name, the layout, which basically changes the header image, and then a few other advanced settings. So that's all you really do in the Pages menu. The, the Editors menu allows you to add other users to your website who can log in and make changes. And in the Pro version, you can actually add different levels of permissions for different users. So if you had different users who required different levels of access, you can accommodate them in the professional version of Weebly. And in the Settings tab, you'll find a lot of basic settings for your website, like changing the domain name, the site title, some basic search engine optimization options, e-commerce settings, mobile settings. In the free version of Weebly, they allow you to add a header image to your website any, on any page, and this is an example of a header image. So on this one, I added a picture on the right, which is the confidential stamp. And then this text, Weebly Review Site, is actually text that was added right into the, the header image area. And then you can customize it for font and add this, um, this light effect to it. So they give you a lot of cool options for adding creative text to the header image area. Now in the professional version, they allow you to add header slideshows. So you'll see this image changes on an animation, so I can add any number of pictures, change the size of the pictures, the options for animation, and change the look of them. So it adds a little bit of a professional look to your website and allows you to add more pictures to the slideshow. So that's a quick overview of Weebly Website Builder. Hopefully that gives you an idea of how easy it is to create a website using Weebly and the drag and drop elements to uh, quickly customize your page. I've used a lot of website builders. And so far Weebly is the best one I've seen considering that they offer a lot in their free version. If you plan on using Weebly, I would highly recommend getting the pro version just because they offer so many added features and the price is really reasonable. Uh, you can go to my blog and I'll provide a link to um, a blog post with more information about what's included in the Weebly Pro version above and beyond the free version. If after watching this video you think Weebly is too difficult for you to use, then you might be a great candidate for my complete website package where I create your website for you and handle everything so that you don't need to do anything. If you're watching on YouTube, there'll be a link to more information on my complete website package. If you're on my website watching this video, just click on services and complete website package. I'm only offering that service to 200 clients, so make sure to check it out and lock up your spot. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you on the next one.